Okay, there we go. Two windows in. Oops. Two windows in. Framing around the windows done. This one is partially framed. I'm going to finish this one out probably tomorrow. But um, this little cutting and trimming, and I'm putting extra braces in between and underneath the windows just to give it more stability. I just I didn't like the way the previous person had kind of left it so open and vague. But anyway, so um, okay, I'll show so you from now. From the outside, windows are sealed. Um, I put that silicone caulking around it, like I said, or the caulking uh, sealant adhesive. So those windows shouldn't leak. Um, and I'm going to do the leveling around the entire top of it and all the edges. So we'll see how that goes when we get there. I just took the piece of wood paneling down from here. Ooh, that's hot. And um, what I found was... For insulation, someone stuffed a bunch of wool clothing up there, which, yeah, wool is good insulation, but I'll tell you why I had a problem with it. Because it was wrapped around, these wires were up there with it, and wool is flammable. So, um, I would rather just put regular insulation up in here, and I'm going to put some Reflectix up underneath that it before I put the paneling on and I'm not going to do paneling I think I'm going to use all those wood slats because I, I just like I said I've always kind of wanted one that looked like that so I'm going to leave the cabinets the cabinets going to be painted but I think all the the walls that are good that are up there I'll probably just go ahead and leave I'm maybe but the ceilings all going to come down I'm going to do all the wood slats and we'll go from there but definitely need some good insulation in here and definitely need to throw all that in the trash and that's the piece I took down because it had gotten discolored and I could have painted over it but it was from where I was showing you the other day where it had rained inside all right so I was working inside the camper framing out this final piece that is basically right here well no actually it's back here on this curve and I realized there was nothing to attach the framing to there I had just, I don't know if it had rotted away and when they took out the paneling, it wasn't there. So I was taking it off to look at it and this is what I found inside the wall here. I don't know if you can see it, but this is all rotted out, which, you know, I really can't say that I didn't expect it, but, um, and it's okay. It's not that big of a deal. Uh, I can repair that and then this is the underneath you couldn't see if you look from there you couldn't see it but once you pull this back it just started crumbling and you can actually see up inside there so anyway plenty of work to do it just makes the project all that more exciting 